one I look pink or orange whatever you want to call it anyway so right now I'm going to show you my room uh, I finally got a camera charger so that's good and um, that means I will be able to show you my room now um, a lot of you have been requesting this because you guys know I moved also thumbs this video up if you really want me to do daily vlogs because I have started to do a daily vlog uh, I started yesterday, so should be interesting. Uh, thumbs this video up if you would like to see those, and um, I will include in this video the packing process as well. So let's get started. Hey guys, so guess what I'm doing? I'm getting ready to freaking move again. Like, I've moved, let's see, in the past five years I've moved like three times no I moved to California moved yeah five times in the last five years I'm just gonna show you guys um, what I'm doing to get ready to pack and stuff like that and I think we're moving into our house today I'm really really hoping because we're all really ready to move we're like sick of waiting my room is the same I have all these boxes right here that I need to fill up and uh, put together and stuff so that should be interesting and I'll just start with one section at a time but let me put these boxes together and then we'll get going two boxes done uh, I don't know what I'm going to put in here first I think I might start with my closet surprisingly I think I might fold all my clothes and just put them in there um, or I might put my clothes in the suitcase yeah I think I might do that so I guess I'm gonna start over here with my shoes and then work around the room oh I'm just gonna take like all of these shoes and throw them in that box I'm gonna bring the box over here so I'm gonna put boots in I have another box with shoes in it but um I'll just keep those ones in there so let's take these put it in here And more shoes. And I think, uh, I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work, guys. I'm just going to throw them in there. I'm going to have to lift this box somehow. Without ripping it. Oh my god. Okay. Put it on the bed. This is going to be so tough. Alright. So I have some more shoes. So this is where that little shoe rack was. I have to vacuum that a little bit. I'm going over stuff with my uh, roommates on what to get. But anyway, so this is the first box that's done. Um, now I'm just going to fold it up and tape it down. First box done! Woo! So this box, I think I want to start putting like little knickknacks in or no actually I'm going to use that for the smaller box for this box I think I'm going to um put what should I put in here I really I don't know I think I might start putting the office stuff in there that's what I'm going to do so that stuff over there into that box and then we'll go from there okay so I finished two boxes sorry I didn't record it but basically what I put in there um was just like office stuff, my printer, uh, all the DVDs, stuff like that. And then the bottom one, as you know, is shoes. So this one, I'm going to fill up with school supplies and um, some little knickknacks. And then the rest of the boxes I'm going to fill up with um, clothes, makeup, hair stuff, stuff like that. So I should be done soon. This is going like pretty fast, so I'm pretty excited. Hey guys, so I haven't been packing because we... I'm moving until Wednesday and today's Monday but since tomorrow I'm gonna probably be like finishing up all this I'll just show you what I've done so far here I just filled it up with like all of my um, um, all my clothes that were up there that were folded and then I'm working on the hanged clothing right now but I don't think I'm gonna put all of them in there because it's really packed so I think I'm gonna make like another box and like I showed you guys before, I have two boxes, or three boxes that are full. I'm not really worried about um, closing them up just because 
I'm literally moving down the street, like right down the street. So not too worried about that. But um, yeah, that's probably about it. And this is an overview of my entire room. It's a pretty good size. I'm really, really happy with it. I have my keys on a thumbtack or whatever. Then I have this Audrey Hepburn poster picture thing that I had in my other room. A lot of the stuff that in here you will have seen in my other room tour. This is just a mirror that I'm absolutely in love with. I got that from Home Goods. Then, of course, this frame my best friend made for me for Christmas. This is my favorite part of my room. I think it just adds like a whole different feel to my room. That's why I put it in here. But I just have different colors. Like I have a lot of white because it's spring and summer and a few turquoise and coral um, pieces as well just to bring the room together. This is just an absolute crazy craziness here. Um, I have clothes everywhere up top and it goes all the way back there. Back there I have some shoes. I have my laundry basket. Nothing too special. I don't want to get into detail. I try to keep my closet color coordinated. I don't really keep it blouse or whatever like that. I just keep it color coordinated, which that's how I like it. On the back of my door, I just have some um, reusable bags for the grocery store. I have my dresser, and um, this is from Home Goods. On the top here, I have some Juicy Couture boxes. I have my heart crystal from the caves. I have this uh, pink perfume. It broke, but I just, I don't know, I keep it there because it smells good, whatever. I have my Aquaphor because you can't freaking live without that. Um, an Eiffel Tower and some flowers that you guys saw in my last room tour. Basically all this is the same. And then in this little drawer I have my watches and stuff like that. And then in this one I have rings and studded earrings. I really love this lamp. I wanted to shut off it, shut it off so you could see it. It's just a glass bottom and I think it's really pretty. I have this painting. This is from Home Goods as well. It's just a black and white painting. And I have these curtains. Um, I don't leave my curtains open just because it's really, really hot outside, so I don't want to let any light in. I'd rather just have that there, and uh, it looks pretty with my room. And then coming down here is my bed. Oh yeah, what the magic, just kidding. Uh, right here I just have this pillow because my neck is really messed up. And the rest of the pillows I got from Home Goods and Target. This one I got from Target, Home Goods, and the pink one from Home Goods as well. And the sheets, all the sheets are from Target. And this is from, from Bed Bath & Beyond, this blanket. Then these two stuffed animals are... the Well, this one I made when I was really young. It's a dog, Build-A-Bear. Then that one my friend... Uh, one for me at Great America. Then my brush is here. I don't know why. This other painting from Home Goods. I just really love it because it, it ties in like the green and the pink theme that I'm trying to go for. I didn't want to get a huge desk in this room just because there's not much space. So I just decided to keep my uh, printer on the floor along with a stack of magazines. I'm not a big fan of it just because, especially for clothes, because it's so little. But it works. I'm going to start on top. Back here I have two Audrey Hepburn books. This one is just a magazine and the one behind it is a biography about her. It's a picture of my mom and stepdad at a fashion show. Then this little figurine thing is just holding this necklace that the guy I'm talking to, John, gave me. Then this is a tree with all my bracelets on it. I'm not going to go through all of them, but um, there's just plenty and it kind of sucks because I get too lazy to take them off of there because I know that everything will fall off so I need to reorganize that sometime but for now it'll be like that okay so coming over here I have my perfume collection these two candles are obviously from Bath and Body Works I'm trying to finish them off from Christmas my phone keeps going crazy uh, so I got this one from for Christmas in my stocking and it's toffee and it actually still has plenty left so I'm trying to Get rid of these before I buy new ones. I have a um, bike helmet uh, because the guy I'm talking to owns a motorcycle and he let me just keep it here. Then I have my steamer, which is amazing. It's way better than an iron. Haven't used it yet, but I love steamers. And down there are just a bunch of cords uh, for my Wii and stuff like that, and then some movies and my Wii. Then coming over here is my little desk, if you may 
uh, want to call it a desk. Um, I'll start at the bottom. Down there I just have some notebooks that I haven't used yet and some binders for like next semester. Like I said, I don't really have enough room for a huge desk, so that's why I got this. But in this little cubby thing, I got these from Marshalls, by the way, um, like these two organizers. This one I just have like all my camera materials, a pair of glasses, I have my phone and my laptop. By the way, my phone case, I'm going to get a lot of questions from that from my um, vlogs, I'm sure. This is from the Mac store, like the Apple store, I mean. I don't know why I call it the Mac. Mm -hmm. I don't know. And then in here I have some school supplies, some mail in the back, and some pencils. This is my planner for school, and this is my file uh, folder. Then up here is just my TV, nothing really special. And I have a lamp, that's from Target. And then down there I have my Wii controllers, which I rarely use because I rarely use my Wii, but just in case. Then I have this full-length mirror. Um, which is pretty useful. I would have made it a little more in depth, but I just wanted to show you kind of an overview of my room and what I'm dealing with here. And I'm absolutely in love with my room. I, it's exactly the way I want it. And yeah, it's pretty girly still. I'm trying to get away from the pink, but I just always keep coming back to like a little bit of pink here and there. So I hope you guys enjoyed that room tour. Um, I honestly... I'm in love with this room and I'm in love with this house like it's it's an, it's, a, it's, a, it's a townhouse so it's not like as like like nice as my old house but I'm just so appreciative and happy especially with the people I'm living with I'm really really happy to live with them so I look so shiny what's going on but yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys later bye